Do you think um, that we ought to have an elected mayor? Or? I would support an elected mayor if that elected mayor was given the power to be able to do it, but there's no evidence that that's the case. Just to just call somebody elected mayor uh, and um, not result in having the power uh, that you will find on the continental mayor or the American mayor. I think we're abusing the title. We uh, just look su uh, superficially at it. Uh, what we've seen over the years is an erosion by government of local government power. They take it away. They control the education system almost totally. Because the, the, he who controls the press streets control it. And uh, if you look at London elected mayor, Ken Livingstone, um, he controls transport because there is a transport system, a London transport system. We have no such system here in Bristol. So <laughs> no elected mayor will control that. And of course Ken Livingstone doesn't control uh, education, which is the one area that people feel that an elected mayor could make a difference and start to get things moving. So uh, I'm sorry, just to call somebody an elected mayor or elect them is only the beginning. What you have to do is look at what the job is and would we give that person the power that are necessary? I'm not sure the public would. But for instance, the French mayor can just stamp a planning application. You have planning permission. That really would be acceptable in Bristol. Somebody want to change the windows in their house, I get half a dozen letters saying I want to be consulted, I want to do this, and planning committees meet and all the rest of it. Is not a system we're used to. I think it's people that don't understand how local government work uh, talk about elected mayor. I would support it if we really changed the whole system of local government and saw this as a better way forward. I'm not convinced.